Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are all doing very well. It's Uprising and thank you guys for joining me in today's video. I really do appreciate it. Sit back, relax, and let's have a little discussion about the item shop in Call of Duty. So for the last couple years, primarily since Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019, there's been a pretty high surge of skins that have been added cosmetically, but at the same time, they are pay to win. I'm looking at MW2's, uh, what is it, the DMZ skins. Some of them were paid to win, but I'm not going to be jumping into that. But what I'm talking primarily in today's video is the skins that are in the item shop. I feel like it's just kind of embarrassing and it kind of shows where Call of Duty is at this current moment. So I was scrolling through the item shop the other day just to see what kind of skins there were. I am not going to sit here and say that I have never bought a skin from Call of Duty or anything because I have. I've bought the Nicki Minaj skin because I'm not a big fan of her or anything, but I thought it was just a funny skin in general. And I kind of regret that instantly. I was trying to buy a 21 Savage skin, but I don't think he was available when I was trying to buy him. And so I went with the alternate option, which probably was the stupidest decision I've made. Honestly, I can't even deny that. And I'm not saying you shouldn't buy any skins from the shop or I'm not saying that you shouldn't buy any funny looking skins because I'll be honest with you. I would actually like to have some skins like this in the game. It's just kind of funny. But when you do this so much and I've seen so many more skins like this, it kind of shows where Call of Duty is heading, right? Like I, I'm as I'm mentioning. I don't really take the game too serious. I don't really play Call of Duty as much as I want to because honestly, it's just kind of stale for me at this current moment. I'm currently waiting for Black Ops 6 and I'm still going to make my call if I'm even going to pick up the game. But when when I'm thinking of these skins, I'm just kind of thinking, is it like Call of Duty taking itself serious anymore? Like Call of Duty has been pushing out updates and updates and updates so frequently, but what they primarily try to focus on is obviously the monetization. And one of the biggest revenue factors for Call of Duty is those skins. And obviously they're gonna focus heavily on trying to monetize their game because they are obviously like, I don't wanna say Call of Duty is a live service game, but I think it is because obviously we do get free updates, free maps and all that. But the only way I think at this current moment is when they, how they make the money is that $70 price tag and obviously the skins. But I mean, as long as it's cosmetic, I'm fine with that. But I really don't like the way Call of Duty's heading and it's not taking itself serious. I really hope with Call of Duty Black Ops 6 in the time period that we're gonna be, which is 1991 if I'm not wrong, I hope that like we don't have these kind of goofy looking skins running around each multiplayer map and just oh brother i just hope that's not what we have but yeah guys i just wanted to make a little video ranting about this this was kind of stupid but um i'm back guys i hope you guys have had a great weekend whenever you guys are watching this video i really do appreciate it i hope you guys have a great rest of your day and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace out